So we're gonna go ahead and check on in. Oh, there we go. I need to refresh this on the Xbox then. We'll be switching to Toon Town after we get a couple of um, stuff done on The Sims. Like, I need them to get a house. We might just have to update them in a second way. We're gonna name her Claudia. Ravine. So, Claudia Ravine. We're gonna have her be... We're gonna have her meet her... No, soulmate. We wanna meet her soulmate. So, she's me a jealous sim. She's going to be a good sim. And she is going to be a freaking. So, oh yeah, I forgot. We're going to do some pets. I forgot about our pets. Okay, so we're going to do a doggo. And we're going to make it a puppy. Because puppies are adorable, and we love puppies around here. Okay, so. We'll make the age a puppy. It's gonna be a puppy. It's gonna be a puppy, puppy, puppy. It's gonna age up with us. Okay, so. The breed. Oh, wait, I think I need to go older to get a breed. I think. Okay, so. When we go to an old... An older dog, and we're gonna choose a breed, and then we're gonna age it down to a puppy. Okay. We're gonna go crazy with the coloring too, so we're gonna grab a breed first, though. Okay, so I think this Sims household would have a small dog, so we're gonna filter breeds. We're gonna do dog size, small dog. Look at all the small dog choices. This is cute. Stop being cute. I think we're going to go with, um, I think we should go with, hmm, this is actually difficult. I don't even know what this is. I think we're going to go with, hold on, Popper. Ooh, we should do English Cocker Spaniel. Yeah. So much cuteness. Okay, so we're going to eat it down to a puppy. And then we're gonna mess with the coloring. Let's see how cute it looks as a puppy. Oh my goodness, look how cute. Cute puppies are so adorable. Stop being so flipping cute. Okay, so we're gonna do some crazy colors. Cause we know I'm not natural around here. On the sentence. So we're gonna go to some crazy colored patterns. I'm not going to change much more about the dog. Except the color. Oh, oh my goodness. Look at her. She's still so cute. How? Okay, so we're going to make her playful. And I think we should make her vocal. Yeah, let's make her vocal. I think she's a her. I mean, I'm sorry, him. The dog is a him. Alright, you're gonna change the dog's pronouns? Wait, what? Look at this, you can change the dog's pronouns. Yeah, that's cute. Um, kudos. His name is kudos. That's adorable. Okay, kitty cat time. Kitty cat time. Kitty 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 meow meow. Okay. Don't judge me. You're probably already judging me. I'm going crazy. Meow. 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 Okay. So. Kitty. Kitty, 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 kitty. Okay, so. Hmm, this is actually a hard choice. Maybe this cat here. I 
mean, I don't know what kind of cat you are. How many color patterns do you have? You do not have many, but we can change the pattern into a six one. I'm gonna keep randomizing until I find the six one. There we go. Ooh, calico. A Benedictine calico mix thing. Okay, so now we're gonna make you go younger. We're gonna make you a kitten. Oh my goodness, that's so adorable. Stop being so flipping cute, you adorable thing. Wait, go back to the blue. There we go. Green. Oh my goodness, this is adorable. Stop being so flipping cute. Right. Here's our little home. I know the cats and the dog look funny. I'm gonna put some collars on them actually so people know that they're owned. Oh wait, no I can't because they're kitten. They're kitten and puppy so I can't put collars on them. Nibbler. Her name is Nibbler. So cute. I'm loving it. I'm gonna go ahead and share the household to the gallery. So people can use my house if they want to. Um, just put them in their home or town and play with them. <laughs> okay, so no one in this household's related, so that's all, another thing, and this is what I like about it. But I already have an idea for the um vampire. We're gonna go live in Forgotten Hollow. Mm. I'm gonna go ahead and do a little cheat here. I play the game with cheats all the time. And I'm not doing a challenge, so this is fine. Oopsies, I messed it up again. I was playing the game as it should be played. So yeah, we're gonna go in this furnished. We're gonna get the vampire a, a coffin. I just got them hollow because it's like perfect for the Sims household. Hold on. I'm gonna get to my stream manager. On my phone. There we go. Alright, so. Alright. So now we're going to. First of all, I need to make sure there's food bowl and a litter box for the kitty and doggy. I mean, the litter box is for the cat, obviously. So I'll make sure there's a litter box in the bathrooms. I know where the cat is in the house. Okay, so this is a two bedroom home. Obviously, it's meant for a child. We can adopt a child in a bit if we want to. Um. Or we can have one of these Sims marry. Oh, is it Sunny? Oh no. She needs to get inside. Go inside. Go inside. Go inside. Go inside. Go inside. Thank you. Go inside. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Oh no. Um, uh-oh. There's garlic on this house. Where's the garlic? There's garlic everywhere. Oh no. 
I need to get rid of the garlic or the vampire is not going to be able to sleep here. Gotta get rid of the garlic. Gotta get rid of the garlic. Get rid of the garlic. Rocky, shush. The garlic will go away. The sim must be able to sleep and relax in their own home. Rocky, shush. He might need to go potty or something. No, he's just whining to whine. He does not need to go potty. He doesn't potty before stream. I need to get the garlic off the house. What's the matter, bud? Do you need to go potty? Yeah, he might actually need to go. You know, I'd probably be better if I just got something from the gallery. Hold on, Rocky. Hold on, Bubba. Let me get rid of the garlic. So my vampire doesn't... not want to go inside the home. That's probably why she wouldn't come inside the home at first. There's so much garlic on the house. Rocky, stop! I'll let you out in just a second, Bubba. Hold on. I know, buddy. I hear you. Okay. I'll continue to lean in the garlic after I bring the dog back inside. He needs to go potty. I'll be right back. I'll bring my phone with me, though, so I can watch the chat by MBRB at the moment. I am back and we need a leading this garlic. 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 The vampire needs to be able to stay safe in her own home. Look at all this garlic I'm having to delete from this house. Oh my goodness. All this garlic. Rocky, go away. Go lay down. I just let you out. What else do you want? Go lay down.
go lay down, mister. Rocky, go lay down. I think he wants the room of the house. You can room the house later. Go lay down. Do you want to go roam? Do you want to go roam? Is that what you want to do? Do you want to roam? He's tilting his head. Stop being cute. Is there more garlic in this room? I want my sim vampire to be able to feel comfy. Oh my god, there's still garlic clouds. Where's the garlic? Oh my goodness. Stop with all the garlic! Imagine having this much garlic in your home just to avoid vampires. Forgot this house is covered in it. It feels like cheating because I'm getting a lot of money just from selling all this garlic. Rocky, what do you want? Stop. I think he wants to roam. Would you go lay down? Do you want a treat or something? Go lay down. Alright. I'm trying to play. Okay, I think all the garlic's gone. Okay, so all the garlic should be gone now, I'm pretty sure. Go lay down. Okay, so we have... How many sims? Four. Hold on, I need to count the sims. The sim human, human sims. One, two, three, four. Yeah, we have four sims. So I'm gonna change the double bed into a bunk bed for two of them, and then the other one's gonna be a loft and a coffin in the kids' room. So we're gonna destroy this room. Good boy, Rocky. So we're gonna go ahead and comfort. We're gonna get the expensive bunk bed. Really? That one's more expensive? What? That's so expensive, but less energy. I mean, I guess that's a more expensive. So we're gonna do the yet. I'm gonna put that straight dab in the middle. I'm gonna get rid of this little uh, situation here. I still see more cloud. I see garlic clouds still. There's a garlic in the kids' room. That's terrifying. Imagine having garlic in the kids' room. I mean, there are. Vampires that will drink from kids. It's terrifying. Okay, so we need to find the coffin for the vampires. Here we go. Will it fit underneath the bunk bed? That's the question. No, it does not. So you can actually have a normal bed there. I think the vampires just gonna have this room to, itself, to themselves. Never mind. Wait, that's too big of a bed. Coffin? Look underneath the bunk bed? No, the coffin will not fit underneath the bug bed. Okay, so I'm gonna switch it from being in the middle to on the edge. And then, okay. So three sims will sleep in here. And I guess a vampire will sleep in here. Okay. There we go. 
And then we got the food. The food. The stuff for the pets to be downstairs. Because they're puppy and kitten. And they can't go very high. So we're going to put the food bowl here. The food bowl is going to be... I'm going to get... Um, hold on. One food bowl is going to be here. And another food bowl is going to be here. Litter box. I think the litter box should be in a bathroom or something. I'm going to put a computer there so we can buy some blood bags. Um, There's only one bathroom in this entire house. Really? Oh no. There's a bathroom over here. So we're going to use this litter box here. Over here. For the little kitty. We're going to put it next to the bathroom, actually, and not in the bathroom. The bathroom is small. Then we're going to put a toy crate and some scratching posts. So hopefully you won't scratch up my furniture. I'm gonna put a little scratching post here near the couch. There we go, a little scratching post. I would put a bed, but I have a feeling the dogs are just gonna get up on the dog and the cat is gonna get up on the couch and sleep there. As long as they stay off the counter, I really don't mind. Okay, so there we go. Oh, wait, I need to put a computer down. Hopefully there's no more garlic in the house, because then the vampire won't go to sleep and won't live here, basically. So, I mean, I'm surprised she even entered the house with all that garlic there. So, we, yeah. We'll get a computer here so we can buy some blood bags. And some plasma for seeds. Let's start planting some stuff. Put this little computer here. There you go. So I'm gonna have her come buy some blood bags real quick. So we're gonna go vampire circuits. Search for information on vampires. You are a vampire. Oh, uh, you already know how to get blood bags. <laughs> vampire secrets. Search for information on vampires. I need to be able to order. So, order, order. Sure. You're not supposed to be video gaming, though. Just researching info on vampires. Vampire secrets. Get your information on vampires. Keep going. Here. And looking at Zadia Strahd. Ah, our new child of the night. As an elder vampire, it's my honor to welcome you to our family. Your new thirst for plasma takes some getting used to. Remember, thirst can be uncontrollable, but it won't kill you. Here are some plasma pots just to keep you fed for the first few days. Just stay out of the sun and you'll be fine. So there's can give me a few. So we're gonna keep going. We're gonna go ahead and search for inf more information on vampires. Cause I wanna be able to order them from here. Did you all manage to already break the TV? What the fuck? Yeah, I'm gonna try to make them energy efficient the best I can. Um, I had that stinking eco-friendly task in. Oh, I ranked up to mine. I don't care that you're bored. You need to be able to order your own food off here. 
Okay, so we're gonna get that vampire tome. So I've exhausted all the information I can from online. I want someone else to look for some frogs for us because I know you can make blood packs from f blood bags from the frogs. So since I have other things I can go out in the sun, I'm gonna have them look for frogs, and I can make blood bags for her. And also send my cat and dog on a hunt to go find some frogs and stuff. I'm gonna have my little vampire sim go socialize with the fam. We'll discuss. We're going to tell a dramatic story. We're gonna become friends with our household. Give a funny gift. Wait, no. You need the blood pack. You need the blood bags because I have some of those funny gifts that you're planning to give. That was rude. Walk away from me when I'm trying to talk to you. Now we go ahead and read. I do need to watch her name. Read. Bitch, read. Well, what's the matter with the puppy? Where's the puppy at? Um, where's the pup? Uh, the kudos needs to go potty. Someone let the kudos out to go potty. Has to go potty. Go ask, go ask the puppy to go potty. Go potty. Okay, they all need to get jobs, I think. Um, I can go one day without needing a job for now. Um, okay, they're choosing their beds. So we have the vampire go ahead and go to sleep. We're gonna claim, and we're gonna sleep. I think you are the only one not sleeping. Yeah, you are. Okay. Meow. We'll go ahead and fill these. Fill 40. Set scheduled time. I'm gonna do one hour each of these bowls. Okay, so there we go. Both those bowls should fill up when they need to. Okay, I hate when someone starts the fireplace because these things always start fires in the house. So we'll watch and see what the fireplace does. If it does start a fire in the home. Okay, you should drink the blood bag. Oh, you did already. Okay, you're a smart sim. Alright, so... Can I order blood bags yet? How long do I have to wait until I can order a blood bag? Order. Oh, I don't want garlic. Order plasma pack. There we go. Okay, I'm gonna order like 20. Now time to go to 30. There we go. I have 32 plasma packs I should do me for now. Oh no. No, she's near garlic. What room? Oh no, there's garlic up here.
We don't want our sim being uncomfortable. No, where's the garlic? It's outside the kid's bedroom. It's outside her bedroom. God, it's outside the vampire's bedroom. <laughs> That's so cruel. I don't know where it's at. Wait, where is she? What does the garlic in your hair then? Still, because she's in the computer. I don't see garlic in here. Do you? No. I don't know where the garlic is at. I think I know who I want her to date, though. I want her to date um, Caleb. I try to have like a vampire baby with Caleb because I think that would be so flipping adorable. So tomorrow or today, so it's a okay. So we're gonna go out and we're gonna go meet Caleb with her. So this will help her get out of this. Um, just gonna be her alone. Well, her. We're gonna try to get her out of the sun as quickly as possible. But we're gonna have her introduce herself to Caleb and start playing with Caleb. So we're gonna try to get him to know her really well. So I already had an idea with this, so we're gonna get going. This is cute and adorable, and I want this relationship to happen. And hmm. this relationship's gonna happen. So we're gonna knock on the door. Knock on the door and hope Caleb's home. Knock on the door. If not, we'll fall in love with Lily. Yes, Caleb's home. Yes. Okay. Oh. Which means Lily will be our sister. Maybe I can have another Sim fall in love with Lily. Okay. So we're gonna go ahead and friendly introduction. We're gonna try. I know you're a loner. Do an impression. Friendly. Ask about day. We're gonna try to be friendly with him. Needed to. I might put on my mods to try to help us go along because I really want this to work. So I'm gonna save real quick. An exit game. We're gonna save and exit. We're not done with the Sims War yet. I'm just saving. And then we'll put my mods back on. I should go on the main menu first. That's what I'm supposed to do. Oops. Hopefully nothing's broken. Which I don't think stuff is broken. So I need to open the game and put my mods on. So give me one minute. It's gonna go nothing for a second on the stream. Okay. I love carrot cake. That's me and carrot cake for breakfast. Leave me alone. Game. I saved and exited you. Just gotta give it a second. Hello. There we go. I gotta bring in the game on and allow mod scripts on, and then I gotta exit it again. So, get a second. I don't really have terrible mods in my game, because I don't play with terrible mods. I don't play with like wicked whims and stuff like that, but I do play with like things to help me cheat relationships and. Have better like pregnancy situations. So yeah. Realistic. I'm a more realistic sim simmer, so I like having realistic stuff. Hello. You gonna catch back up, stream?
what's not gonna matter right now. I'll fix it in just a second. It's not launching some sort yet at the moment. But I'm fixing the mod situation with it first. Anyway, I will set it back up in just a second. Rocky ball. Cause I need it to uh ball. 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 Okay, so we're gonna go ahead and options. We're going to game options. Ball. Get the ball. Get the ball. 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 Enable content modes. The game is for your story first. Yeah. Apply changes. Okay, so we're gonna restart. Exit the game. As soon as it comes back up, I'll edit the window. We'll go back to capture the game like it should be. Mm -hmm. So basically, right now we're in the Maple Story waiting room. So I will be streaming some pups here in a couple minutes after we get at least one baby as of right now. At least one. I know Sims likes to give me twins and stuff like that. Okay, so give me a second. I'm gonna try to connect it back because it's not going to window capture. Sims 4. There we go. We got it. Let's go. Hi, Bubby. Mods, yes. Resume. I'm gonna cheat the relationship because if we don't cheat the relationship, we're gonna be standing here all day talking to one person. Go cool. lay down. I want a baby in this household. We have six sims, which means we can have twins without going over limit the household limit. So I'm gonna try to keep it with twins. If it does, if it's a triplet, I'll just have the triplet get adopted or something by another sim. We'll figure out something. <laughs> it doesn't seem like Caleb likes her immediately off the bat, so gonna take a bit for me to get oh yeah so now I can cheat the relationship so I can do this see command center and we can just do this well, I knew I wanted her to date someone in the world already the relationships affect active friendly. We're gonna do true friends. So active romantic, true lovers. I'm not. I don't like. Since we're not doing a scenario or a challenge, I'm not caring about cheating really much at all. So we're gonna go ahead and romanticize. Romance. Aspie boyfriend. Oh God, my uh, UI is broken. I might need to delete that mod. Um, there's a couple of the uh, cheats that are broken right now, apparently. I think that might be UI cheats. Um, oh, that's because I don't have the. They haven't updated to the Lunar Club stuff yet. So, they're fine. It's just for today. I'm um, just for another hour or so. How long have I been doing it? First kiss. Uh -huh. I'm gonna go ahead and do a first kiss and then we're gonna woohoo. Okay, so we're gonna try for a baby. I'm just gonna pray. I'm gonna pray. 
gonna try for a baby. Let's try for one. <laughs> oh. Okay, how am I still hearing the woohoo music without them woohooing? Game, fix yourself. Um, for a hand tick pregnancy test and hope for it. No! How rude. We're gonna try again. Try for baby with Caleb. I like how I told the game how rude for not making me pregnant. <laughs> Take pregnancy test. Please. Oh. Yes! Alright, yes. She's eating for two. I love. I love. Yes. Okay. Alright, so I think we're gonna go ahead and have her move out with Caleb. I feel like. So I think... She should ask Caleb to move in. Leave Lily here. So we're going to um ask to join household and then we'll move them out to their own home. Get moving in together. We're gonna bring just Caleb. Just Caleb. Just Caleb in. Okay, so we're bringing Caleb in. So now we have Caleb. So we're gonna both go home and we're gonna have them move out from this house. And we're gonna go. And we're gonna stay with this household until they have their pregnancy done, basically. And I'll move on to another sim for a bit. So let's see my uptime as of right now. Give me just a second. And check the previous stream. The previous stream. 37 minutes and 7 seconds. So it's about been an hour of sims. So yeah. What's the uptime for right now? We'll be playing some tune down here in a minute. Minute. Oh. Uptime. For the stream so far. It's for the stream. Four three minutes. So for as soon as I have an hour, we'll be in and basically two hours of Sims. So. Which is pretty much what I wanted. So we're gonna have these two. Oh god. Yeah, you can tell the entire GUI is messed up. I'm not travel. I want you to move. Okay, hold on. I need to delete a mod. I think might be causing it. So hold on. I'm gonna go exit game. Save and exit. We're gonna delete the mod I think is causing this. The UI extension cheats. I don't actually know what mod in general is causing it, but I do need to go ahead and delete some mods and try to figure out the mod, what mod's causing that glitch. Glitch with stuff like that. It should not be that bad. Cheats, UI extension cheats. I wanna go ahead and delete that folder for now see if that does anything okay delete okay. so now we're gonna go back into sims game and hope that helps so i'm gonna delete that because that's probably what's causing it 
I know a lot of the mods have not been updated yet since the update just came out yesterday. So, I mean, I'm gonna give the modders time and stuff first before I start snapping at them because it's not their fault. They kind of need to refresh themselves. I'm gonna delete the window capture and replace it. So I have trouble catching the sims. Yay, there we go. Okay, hopefully that helps. If it's not the UI, we'll figure out what it is in a sec. Because it's always saying something has to do with the display. Resume. <laughs> I'll be switching over to Toontown here in about 45 minutes. Not about 45 minutes, I'm wrong on that timing, but yeah. Maple Story will be what ends off the stream. I will be doing another character on stream, a solo character on stream, on Lyceum. So, yeah. Mm. Well, Alexa, choose my class, though. So, yeah. Maybe I should, like, Google choose my class, or maybe I should just do a randomization thing. If Maple Story is open by the time we're done with um, Boatyard with my four new pups. Which hopefully they'll be open at that point. Mm hmm. I want free earbuds. Who doesn't want free earbuds? Okay, yeah, it was the UI extension. That's what I thought. That's what I thought it was. So. We're gonna have these two, our two little vampire buddies, move. No, I don't wanna move the household. How do I just move two people? Okay, well, I guess I have to go to manage worlds. Save and go to manage worlds. Since she's preggers. And I want her to have as many kids as I would like her to have. We're gonna split up the household. Manage households. We're gonna do this. We'll create a new household. Boom, boom. We'll give them about 20. We're gonna give them 20. There we go. Boom boom. We're gonna move this little house here. Okay, so we're gonna take that household and we're gonna go. We're gonna go to Willow Creek. I move into this two bedroom here. So we're gonna manage households. We're gonna go to this one. Move. I'm gonna go right here. Furnished. So, I'm gonna go play with them until the baby is born. So, yeah, we're basically waiting for the kids to be born. I'm going to deal with the hospital situation with this. So, uh, once she has preggers, she is. Expecting from a particular clue. This pregnancy looks like a special and important time in my Mila's life. She feels responsibly ready for it. A little scared, a little enthused, a little everything to be honest. Some look at her like she just she should be happier. But Mila is just taking it in stride without Where 
a little everything to be honest and look at her like she should be happier but Mila is just taking in stride without any extreme emotion so okay so we'll go ahead and tell Caleb so we're gonna go ahead and let Caleb know we're going to announce 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 the news of pregnancy Like he wouldn't know already. Okay, so they're so happy from announcing pregnancy. Mila's partner was delighted with the news of pregnancy. More than Mila is even. It's good to know Mila will have support. So yeah. Oh, she's thirsty. Let me go ahead and give her some blood bag. Drink. I think I'm gonna go ahead and have Caleb pop the question. I'm hoping Mila is gonna say yes to it because that would be amazing. It'll make me feel so warm inside. So let's go ahead and have Caleb. We're gonna pop the question. I actually did not expect that to work. So since I kind of already just want them to be married, I'm just gonna have a private wedding here. Okay, so we're just gonna do this a little bit immediately with Myla. Just kind of already want the wedding to be done with and over with. So there we go. <laughs> So cute. My sim's gonna be so adorable. Um. So we're gonna try to wait patiently through the semesters. I'm gonna go ahead and have Caleb grab a job. So Caleb, I'm gonna have him become a doctor because vampire and doctor fit. I'm gonna have them both work for a doctor hospital. So we're going to do doctor. We're going to both work for a doctor. Because that just makes sense to me. It just makes sense to me. It really just makes sense to me. They're vampires. So, I mean. She's in second, second trimester in 12 hours. So we to go by. Oh, it's the TV. I think it's the TV. I'm gonna turn off this TV. Yeah, it was the TV. Um, watch channel, watch sports. I'm really excited to see the babies. I think it's me a baby. I'm trying not to see what the kids are gonna be, or it's me more than one kid yet. But what we can do is we can have her go into pregnancy and family, as we can go see discover baby's birth gender. So let's go discover a baby's birth gender. Because I would honestly like to know my baby's birth gender. Welcome, wagon. Go inside, go inside, go inside. What was it? 
go here, go inside. Um, your baby will be born a boy. Oh, okay. So we're gonna have a baby boy. Okay, that's cute. Wait, do a one trimester, one trimester, two hours. Um, I'm gonna, I should place our computer somewhere in this house. Um. <laughs> want the bunk bed for, we can woohoo in, um, coffins. Oh yeah, that's right, you can. I forgot you can. I'm sure for a baby in coffins in some sort. Also, I'm gonna put some coffins in here. I mean, you already know the kids. I mean, we have vampires. I'm gonna put the vampire bassinet down. Cute. So, we're gonna do some coffins. Okay, so where's the coffin? There's one coffin. I need to get rid of the lamp that's sitting here. There's one coffin. We get rid of the dresser. We can have the coffin on the other side of the hall of the room. We're gonna do a nice little bassinet, a vampire bassinet. Here, I'm gonna put three vampire bassinets. I don't know if it's gonna be three kids. Would be really cute if it was. I'm gonna put three little bassinets here. If it's just one kid, that's fine. At least I got the cute idea of having three little vampire bassinets here. Thinks about the switch trimester over into second trimester. I'm too impatient. I want to have the birth already. 24 hours. So on Wednesday at this time, they should be in their third trimester. So yeah. Okay, I'm gonna leave it on pause for a second and I'm gonna go to the bathroom. Cause I really need to use the restroom. I'll be right back. Scarafa! Oh. Um, 
wait. Did I just hear an abduction noise? Hold on. That was too perfectly timing. That was AFK. Sweet. I don't know what that noise was. I'll definitely have to go watch that part of the AFK and left the game unpaused. But yeah. Because I did hear that. What are you gagging at? Oh yeah, we need to put a computer in this household somewhere. So, hmm. We can put a computer over here somewhere, I think. Hi, Rocky. We can move this vampire coffin over a little bit. We can put a computer there. Yeah, that might work. As long as it doesn't conflict with the other coffin, we should be good. Wait, what about here? Yeah, that works. That, I think that works, actually. Does work. Does it really? Should I just do bunk beds instead of coffins? Or just... A Let's just do a wood double bed. We don't need coffin. As long as you don't make one of them being able to only sleep in coffins, then we should be fine. What is a normal bunk bed? I mean a normal double bed. Okay, so there we go. There's a normal double bed. We can put a computer here for him to buy some plasma. Plasma bags. I'm gonna put a surface over a desk here. How will walkie? Hello, Rocky. Okay, so we're going to do this. Comfort, we'll do a desk chair. I'll do this desk chair because it looks kind of cute. I'm gonna do electronics so we can put a computer there now. I like how I just try to put a TV on the desk. I don't want the school only PC. I guess we're gonna afford the shitty one. <laughs> the crappy one. We don't have much money at the moment. Looks like. So. And search for information on vampires on the internet. Call yourself currently Caleb. I feel like Caleb would be better at the vampire thing than a female in this household. Maybe I'm gonna have her order some plasma bags for him. So I'm gonna do that. Vampire secrets, order plasma packs. Boom, boom. Okay, yeah, now we really need that. Not the whole stack, not the whole stack, not the whole stack. Wait, why? Why did you give him the whole stack? Okay, so I guess I'm gonna cheat a little bit of money for him. So she can get herself some 84 blood bags. Okay, so. Ka ching. Ka ching. Do this, do this. Mother Boom. I don't want them dying because they don't have plasma. I mean, it won't kill them. They just have to go find humans in that case. How did them not do that? I 
she's in Skilo doesn't like going after humans. There we go, 84 blood packs. Damn. There we go. We're about in almost 20 hours into an extra semester of the pregnancy. So when does she start work? I want to be on the other- work in three days. So I will be in the other household once they start work. I'll be in a different home household, so, yeah. Mm, she should give birth before the work days even start, so I mean, that's perfect. Well, she's gonna have family leave before her even first work day. So, wait, she's done third semester in 17 hours. Okay. <laughs> oh, yeah, thank you, Trumpy, for the hydrate. Um. Quack! I know that took me a minute to see Chomster. Oh, I was feeling lost in the stream situation being glitchy. It's day four out of seven of spring. So basically, her aspiration. I'm gonna read her aspiration real quick while we're waiting for pregnancy. Um, vampire family. She wants to purchase the vampire creation power, become a minor vampire, which I think she's already a minor vampire. What's her vampire level? You're a minor vampire, so I did that count. Okay, it did. You know, purchase the vampire creation power by using powers, drinking from Sims, searching vampire lure. Okay, so let's see if she can. Looks like fame. Hey, you. See what she can purchase. We're gonna purchase this. I'm going to garlic immunity. I'm gonna get that as well. Um. E tech personality. And cast hallucination. Oh, I need a weakness, huh? I do need a weakness. Um, I need to get two then. I want this, and then we choose a weakness of uncontrollable hissing, and then grad community. And cast hallucination. And you can do. Bat form, one of the bat forms. Go. Boom. So now she can create other vampires. So anyone she bites, she can turn into their friends. So. Okay, so. And now if a human sim comes up and asks her, they can turn them into a vampire. So. So I can pretty much show you how that works by using the goth family. So, so she is in a trimester and she was going through something. For her travel, it's early enough, right? Oh, it's maybe too early. I'm gonna give myself a bit, actually. I'm gonna give myself to like 8 a.m. 
It's only 5 a.m. in the morning. So, we're gonna go change to someone in the goth family to a vampire. Let me go use the goth family as an example. I think she can still do it while pregnant. Hoping she can. So, we're gonna wait until like 7 a.m. when more people are awake. Go. So, we're gonna travel by ourselves. Okay. So. Oh, they have a baby here. Oh, we have a baby. Yeah, so. Yeah. I'm gonna ignore myself from that. Since they're both out here, I'm gonna be friends with Cassandra. So I'm gonna cheat my friendship with Cassandra to get this done with quicker. Okay, first of all, I'm gonna go knock on the door so we can go inside because I don't wanna be out in the sun. Knock on door. Okay, so I'm gonna keep the relationship with somebody in the household. I might do Cassandra. Cassandra looks like she just needs a grub. Where are all the Sims go? I wish Sims wouldn't move that fast. It's so hard to keep up with them and click on them. Um. There's Cassandra. So, what gender is this baby here? Just trying to read the name. I guess I'll never know. Okay, so we're gonna. I'm just gonna say, Rocky, shush. Go lay down. Relationships. We're going to set active relationship levels. So active friendly, true friends. Okay, so. We're gonna go offer to turn her. So we're gonna go vampire. I'm gonna treat my vampire and I just need to do this. I need to go sleep or something, I think. Okay, stop whining and crying all the time. Stop being a crybaby. Stop it. Stop. So, do you go lay down? Go lay down. Active household. Feel needs current lot. Okay. That should give her enough social. That should give her enough vampire energy to change Cassandra into a vampire. So. Yes, I know. It's weird that I'm using a teenager as an example, but turn into vampire. We're gonna go ahead and turn her. We're gonna take a teenage kid and turn her into a vampire. That's so messed up. Cassandra, no! Fuck, school. I forgot about school. Okay, I'm an idiot. I forgot about school. Um. Okay, so I might just move in a sim. So y'all can see how the vampire situation works. So I'm gonna go home. I might just call a human sim forward. Rocky, shush! All you do is cry. Wait, is mom home? Maybe is that why? No. Go lay down. Lay down or something, please. Don't behave yourself once in a while. Wait, there's a sim here. Okay, I can use them as an example. So this one's here, right? We're gonna cheat their friendship. I'm just gonna do this real quick so I can get her out of the sun. Okay, 
So vampire, turn into vampire. Quickly do it. Quickly do it before you burn. Quickly do it before you burn. Actually, pregnant swims can't die. Okay, so that's when it fails. Alright, so I guess I'll just wait for a little bit. We're gonna go here. We're gonna go inside. Which is weird, because I've never seen the yacht turn into a vampire fail before. So, that's cool. Oh. My trimester is she in? Third trimester in four hours. What do you want? Do you want to go roam? Is dad home? It's just gonna go see your dad's home. I'm gonna let the game run, and I'll be right back. I is back and we should be in our final trimester. Oh. I was gonna call from Lilith. I don't feel like trying something new and exciting. Something like changing careers. What do you think? You should follow your heart. I guess. 
So she should be in her third trimester. From yep, she's in her third trimester. She have a baby born soon. Back away, you want me to turn into a vampire? Get away from me. Right. Your human falls in love with the alien. We'll figure out what happens to the alien in Spellcaster soon. I think the Spellcaster should fall in love with the male. <laughs> I'm gonna look up the Sims for spellcasters and figure out who are all spellcasters in the Sims for. Sims for community spellcasters. Sims for Townie casters. Looks like we might have to go with a Daryl Charm. Seems like we're a Gemma Charm. Gemma Charm's a teenager. Oh. <laughs> okay, so we'll let's try to find one of those. Hold. <laughs> well, first of all, we're gonna wait for this one to give birth. So I was waiting for this little. I might have to just put her in labor so we can move on to the other, oh, the other house. I'm trying to have patience. I'm trying to have patience here, guys. And I don't have much patience apparently. <laughs> I'm gonna do an up time. When we move out of this house, when we leave this household, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna set them as a library situation. So if it's one kid, I can just have one bassinet there, a toddler bed, and eight kids' bed. There we go. Because that's what they need at the moment. They'll move out into a house that they need more when they have more children. So then put the story progression on their home. Oh, her name did change when she got married. That's good to know. It's realistic. Okay, so... I need to stop rotating because I'm probably making all of y'all dizzy. I'm just waiting for this to... increase. Oh. 
me see what that is. If I can. The front door ring's kind of broken and old. I'm dying. Well, what was it? I'll be right back. Let me go see what that was at the front door. Because I can't see.
Say? <laughs> Ooh, Slurpee. Sorry about that, guys. I am back, and it looks like Arson had a baby boy. So let's name him Tobias. So cute. I mean, you already know he's gonna be a vampire because there's vampire parents. So I think it's time to switch over. Yeah. <laughs> 
Alright, so I think it's time to switch over to some Toontown. I think we've had about an hour of Sims. So I'm gonna go switch over to Toontown now for about an hour two hours and then we'll switch over to Maple Story for the end. So yeah. I'm gonna go switch to the other household later on. I'm gonna do some stuff off stream. That thinks he feels so bad and sad now. Oh. We're gonna go ahead and save and exit this. Because we're no longer gonna be streaming Sims at the moment. So I'm going to change my category back to Toontown for a little bit because I still don't think Maple Story is open yet. Yeah, so we've been about two hours of Sims. So we're going to go do... Let me see if Maple Story is even open yet. Actually, I'll wait just a little bit. Let me change my category first. Add stream info. We're going to change the category and I'll change the title from here. So I'm not going to change the title. I'm just going to change my category. Toontown Online. Here we go. Done, done. Alright. There we go, our category is now changed. We're gonna go into some Toontown. And then we'll finish it off with some Maple Story. Uh, I'm gonna do a couple tasks with my four pups. All right, so. Let me see if Maple Story's up. So we'll get them out of boat yard at least today, if anything. I went and asked. Looks like you know Johnny used to sneak into her garage all the time. <laughs> oh goodness. Okay, 
wrong tune. Let me just a second. Well, these guys aren't technically connected to the show, I can stream them when I want to. So. Yeah, yeah. Wait for the game to decide to load up. I'll be right back. Hold up, I need to exit and refresh the launcher. I'm gonna go. Um, hold on, one sec guys, it took me. If Toontown doesn't load up, I'll switch over to Maple Story and I'll just play Maple Story for a bit. Hold on, my launcher is acting up. If I can't get the launcher to respond, I'll just switch over to Maple Story and hopefully Maple Story is open. No. Um. We can go and watch clips until Maple Story opens. Let's see if Maple Story is open. Let's 
it's not it's still down for maintenance we'll go watch clips and call it stream maple story waiting room for now so it doesn't seem like toontown wants to open either right now Keep trying the tin town. I'm gonna switch my um, if I have to, I'm gonna have to switch my thing to while I'm just chatting and do some clip viewing for a minute or so, maybe. I'm trying to see if it's down for maintenance still or not. I don't know how much long it's gonna be on maintenance. Let me see. Maple story. For sure, Maple story should be back up hopefully by now. I I would hope. Um. Okay, it's taken a minute. They are still offline. Okay, I might have to reboot. Hold on. Let me try to just do a normal tune for a minute. I may in tune or something. One moment. And see if it actually loads. Oh my god, what is wrong with this thing? Why are you breaking? It's not making sense. I'm gonna stop stream. I'm gonna exit OBS and try to let Clash open and I will be 